what's up everybody uh jared here again um literally this is embarrassing embarrassing i'll say it right off the bat when it comes to people looking at people getting pokemon because these are the stories that people see like oh pokemon adults buying pokemon that's insane dude you think they would grow up a little well these videos show you why not if you haven't seen it already we're gonna go ahead and look at this tiktok clip from costco where everybody's been buying out the 151 tins because it's a five pack and i think they're 40 dollars. some are 37 dollars, something like that uh, i've seen a couple price tags here and there but there's they're cheaper now if you'd have bought these five tins and you were able to find them normally they they do run like ten dollars a piece so you're saving there as a consumer of pokemon you can actually save something if you have a costco account but anyways, these guys go to Costco, and I mean, they're geniuses. If you if you just grab it all at once, it's worth millions. They know it, it's, it's just so crazy. It's just so crazy. What happened? 151 has been popular, but what happened? I have definitely missed something. If someone knows what stone got unturned where people were just going crazy now, for the last year, like when it first came out, people flipped out. But like for the last year, I was able to find it here and there. They would do restocks constantly. Which, all right, let's go ahead and watch this video. Let's watch this video. Oh my God. Oh my God. Okay. Look at them go. They're just throwing them. Why are they throwing them? I think some of them, yep, Paldean Fates. There's Paldean Fates tins too. So they're, oh. So they're not like all mixed in, I think. Okay, that makes more sense now, re-watching this video. But it is crazy. That guy's just stomping on stuff. Carts, carts full of 151. That guy's about to take his cart. Oh, no, not even his cart. 151. Ah, guys, guys, what are we doing? Did you see that guy though? I mean, come on. I think that guy was stealing that guy's cart. And he walked away, he walked away. Oh, guys, I just don't get it. I don't get it. I don't get it. If you see these stuff reselling online, let's look on eBay. That's what we'll do. eBay. I know they're selling for a higher price. They have to be. But um, yeah, we got $69. We got $159. That's 20 booster packs. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. Yeah, you would be spending, you're spending an extra $60 for the tins, which is, it sucks. But I mean, these people are not making that much. You have to pay fees and stuff like that. Like, what are you doing? Maybe you're selling them locally. I don't know. It's not really that big of a deal, in my opinion, for the fact is that, let me look here. Yeah. Here's the complete and sold on eBay recently. November 3rd. We are on November 3rd, that is today. We got one that's less than $74 with free shipping for one of them. They paid $34, $40, or whatever it was, $40. I mean, you're not making much. You're not making much at all for the, the panic of it. And the thing is, I don't know why people are buying it either. I am grateful that we do have some 151. Every time I've seen it, I've seen it in stores or online, actually online. Walmart had it online for sale, the booster bundles, literally for like two days straight. 48 hours, you were able to buy it, no problems. That's what we've been opening up on the channel for the last couple of months. Every Sunday we've been opening it up. But my God, like I get it if you see it, but you don't need to do that. Like running over people, showing up at Costco, waiting in line to go get it. That could be fun. You can meet other collectors. Like I'm not even, there's no problem in that. Like, oh, let's wait in line and go get it. But when you're throwing things in the store throwing things in the store bypassing other pokemon product just let's get it out of here literally throwing it not like hey i don't want to buy it that's fine throwing it it's nuts it's nuts these people are crazy man these people are crazy it's 20 it's 2020 21 all over again but the thing was with that everybody remember the thing with that was there was legit supply chain issues pokemon now owns a printing press for their cards like they own a printing facility for their cards they will print this again if they don't it's kind of confusing on their part because uh that's money on the table for them they could sell this at normal price 
put it up on their website, which they have been. And there's a new box coming out. Guys, I if you see it out and you want it, get it. But there is just no reason to be throwing stuff in stores. But I, I'm not here to tell you what to do. I just wanted to show this video. It got sent to me a hundred times. You've probably seen it. But let me know what you think down below. This is just crazy. This is just crazy. I just don't think it's worth it. 151 will be sought after for years, 100%. Like, there's a no-brainer. But, guys, I just don't get it. I don't get it. Have fun out there. Have a great day. I'll see you later, guys. Peace. Peace. Hey, look look at all the pumpkins. I got pumpkins back here. Different background for a bit. All right. Bye. <laughs>